All right, what's up, Roddy? It's Bman 1313, and good morning. And off we go. I know it's a little early. But all is well, all is good. I slept great. Oh, no, little rabbit, don't. Little rabbit trying to run out on me. I slept great. Um, I feel wonderful. I fell asleep really early. I mean, I was, I was beat yesterday. I was beat down tired, and so I slept wonderfully, wonderfully good. And uh, I actually did. I actually slept really good. So I got up, I had to pee really bad, too much information I know, but um, it is what it is. And uh, yeah, I mean, get going so we could get going, you know? I could rush home and be home in like three hours. Three and a half, I believe. Or I could enjoy my weekend a little bit more. And, uh... Keep working my way home. But hit up some cool spots. That I don't get to see that often. Or hit that often. My only concern right now is the sun going to be up. <laughs> or is it going to be light enough to enjoy and see and have fun with? Um... It's 6.15 now. Actually, 6.13.13. 13. Um, and I'm not sure what time the sun comes up. But. It's all good. Let's just start heading where we're going to head to. And, uh, you know, what if I, if I pull over close to that spot and just turn on my lights and eat breakfast cook my breakfast that's fine that's perfect too so uh yeah let's hit that on let's head on out let's go let's go let's go all right all right all right all right if i still got 30 minutes to my spot then there's going to be plenty of light for me to cook breakfast there at, at that area that i'm going to go to so there's two things there i want to check out actually three but I'm gonna call it two two things there that I enjoy seeing and doing and so I'm gonna head to that and unless there's something super interesting on the way I'll catch you there Start our dirt roads adventures right here. I truly have no clue where I am as far as I just passed I-16, and that's all I can tell you. And if you go far enough this way, you'll hit Swainsboro way down the road. I think I'm gonna have to retire this chair. You hear the yeah. Maybe when I get out, I'll put it back in the back because I'm done with it. I love this chair. I love how it folds flat. Even though it's kind of big, it folds flat. But it rattles. And me not like you that. <laughs> Rattling is not good. We're gonna go back up that way when we come back. We're gonna go up here just a couple miles up here and turn around and do our thing up here and then turn around and come back. I don't know how muddy, ooh, I don't know how nasty this is gonna be, but. Pretty slick. 
in spots. In spots, it's pretty slick. Cool long bridge here. Oh, I might survive the drone since I haven't tried that out in a while. <laughs> Oh, this is all wet up here. Cool bridge, cool bridge. Water's moving. Cool bridge, cool bridge. I did fish in here one time. And I think I will now as I cook up some breakfast. Pull up in here and cook a little breakfast up. Well, not the uh, not the best start to the morning here. Had a great start to the morning, just not a not a great continuation to the morning here. Burnt my breakfast trying to fish. Didn't catch a fish. GoPro has no battery life left. That thing. Yeah, it's just been like little dumb things. Nothing, you know. Nothing crazy major. This is like a dune here. It's kind of a neat little spot. I'm just going to make a loop. That was... The bridge was spot one. The little water hole was spot two. This is kind of spot three, as I call it. It's this little uh, dunes area. A little water crossing here. Not so little. So I have no cell cell service. I was trying to install the drone. I reset my phone, and uh, <laughs> I reset my phone. And some of the apps I was just going to install apps as I needed them, as I. But you know, of course, now I need the DJI drone um, app when there's no cell service. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was just a interesting morning. It's been a little funky morning with that kind of stuff happening. Um, burnt my breakfast. I, uh, trying to fish I burnt my breakfast didn't catch a fish uh, which that's not a big deal um, try to video stuff and the GoPro was dead which I haven't used for crap I guess I did I used it at the save so I hadn't charged it that's my fault but still and then uh, Went to fly the drone and forgot I had reset my phone. And so the... Huh, uh, put on my seatbelt. Um, yeah, I went to fly the drone. The uh, I reset my phone and so I didn't have the, the app. Well, I'm out here with no cell service. And so that was that. No drone. Bummer. Bummerlicious, bummerlicious. So, you know, I try to go away from things, but this DJI just keeps on kicking. 
This would be a pretty cool spot to camp. I don't think you can camp in here. You're out here in the middle of nowhere. Look how pretty that is. Yeah, a nice little spot there. Let me check out if you could camp in here. I don't think so. I would not think so. This is a, I want to call it a pretty protected site. Soft sand here. Whoa, yeah. Whoa, yeah. I think you could probably come in here on foot and get away with some camping, but I don't know about trying to open up my RTT up in here and camping up in here. I'm going, I'm going. But it's a sand dune in the middle of Georgia. <laughs> It's crazy. I gotta find the name of it. I don't think. Oh, now I have service. Damn, now I have full service. Let's download the drone and see. Do this, and then go. I was only an hour away, and it was on my way home, so that's why I wanted to hit it up. Now there's some um, primitive camp spots that I want to go check out. That's my other. Um, the other thing I want to do today before I get home before I get out of all this area yeah this is just a pretty neat place pretty neat place I've only been here a couple of times and enjoyed it every time one of the few creek crossings out this way and uh and this is only the third time I believe I've been in here and it's been a good <laughs> it's always been wet I mean in the summer hasn't mattered yeah I'm, I'm I get to a point where I'm just ready to go home I, I get so frustrated with the stupidest thing so you know I already told you I burnt my breakfast trying to fish I didn't catch a fish which was fine not a big deal um I tried a video, but the GoPro died because I didn't charge it. Um, then I tried to fly the drone, but I forgot I reset my phone, and so then I didn't have the DJI um, app. And then um, <laughs> I downloaded an app. I parked there because I had cell service so I downloaded an app that says DJI go fly and it has so many advertisement commercials you couldn't even get to the you couldn't even get to the thing it was I don't that's not what I had downloaded that's not what I used before and so oh my gosh like yeah that's not it uninstall that son of a gun yes please uninstall that's horse crap I need to go and rate that thing make sure people don't buy that crap so I had bought my mom a phone <laughs> story time shouldn't do it here because this is too pretty of a place to tell stories at but bought my mom a phone with my line she had a track phone that was just crap and so I bought her a phone on my line and uh yeah well she doesn't know how to use it she won't use it she says she can't use it and then she's like i try to write you <laughs> she doesn't understand that her tablet because she's used to her tablet and she's really good with her tablet look at this beautiful spot here let's just be quiet and enjoy this real quick it's like i went the wrong way didn't it So that's where we burned our breakfast, didn't catch a fish. You know, these are first world problems that I'm having. It's not like I'm having issues that are just... But those little issues just get to me sometimes. Cool little uh, bridge here. Nice long concrete bridge. It's just funny. A video here real quick. Let's see how long this stupid GoPro lasts.
All right, well, I got a video. I'm trying to get to. Got a little bit of a fog drizzle type thing going, so that kind of sucks with the camera and with the recording. But let's go see what we see here. Here we go. I'll have to look a little harder on the map to see if they connect. You have to have a license. Um, fishing license or a hunting license fishing license is the cheapest thing to then the, the cheapest thing to have if you're a Georgia resident it's 15 bucks and you can get one for a few years and you don't have to worry about it for a few years every few years and so um, that's the way to go with that it's good to have and just anytime you're in here I've been checked plenty of times um, so don't don't think <laughs> Just because you're driving through or whatever, you can stop to pee or something and they just happen to come around. They're checking your license to make sure you have a fishing license. I don't even know that there's a fishing spot in here. And yet, you have to, you know, you can have a fishing license and it'll, it'll cover your entrance fee, as I call it. This is where I was going to try to come to yesterday. But again, I wasn't sure if it was legit. You know, you have to check them out because sometimes they just don't. And then I also had to, I, I was still an hour. I was going to come in here in the dark. Yeah, see, camping area. Sweet. Nice little, uh little spot. Let's check this out real quick. Alright, so camping area here. Let's go and check out the uh... Oh, it's all in there. Oh, this is even bigger than I thought. And you got some water and stuff. That's cool. Let's gonna come and check in here the map. Hunting book. This is nice. Buy a license. Lagoons. This must be where we are. Doesn't look like I can get back out there to that other. There's another entrance. It doesn't look like it. It matches up. This wouldn't be bad at all, actually. It's not a bad spot. You got some water. Yeah. Cool. Definitely marking this on the spot. On the map, this is gonna be uh, this will be on there. There you go. All right, well, successful. And uh, I'll leave the these roads to explore later. That'll be cool. Let's start looking now for our next spot that we're headed to. 